Drew Dober thinks that many UFC fans would be happy to witness him smash Patty Pimblett. The 34-year-old lightweight is now rated number 14 in the UFC following his spectacular victory over Bobby Green in December, which was his third consecutive stoppage victory. Dober and Green had a challenging first round, but Dober was able to break through Green's guard and win the fight of the night prize. Dober has stated his readiness to take the fight in a meeting with Michael Bisping and Anthony Smith, and there are reports that he may face Pimblet in his upcoming fight. That's one exciting fight. I mean I think everyone wants to see me punch Patty in the mouth and to test his scouser theory, but it's really all up in his field. I'm not above fighting anybody, and especially someone as well-liked as this guy. But the ball's in his court, so I've accepted. I'm all for it. I'm ready to go whenever he wants. Now we're just waiting on him. Dober admitted that although there is currently no official agreement in place for a fight with Pimblet, he realizes that Pimblet's massive fan following gives him the freedom to chose his opponents. Gilbert Burns is hoping that Conor McGregor will receive a knockout punch from Michael Chandler. The 31st season of The Ultimate Fighter has Chandler and McGregor as coaches. At the conclusion of the season, they will square off in the octagon. According to Dana White, the battle will take place in the lightweight division. The TUF 31 broadcast is scheduled to start in late May and go until mid-August. Burns recently expressed his displeasure about one of his pals being kicked off the program so that McGregor could bring in his own crew. Burns is solidly behind Chandler and believes that this battle will be difficult for him, but he is confident that Chandler will prevail by way of a knockout over McGregor. Here is what he said. I think this is a tough fight for Michael Chandler. I don't think it will be an easy fight. But I hope Michael knocks him out. I hope Michael wins. I don't want to wish anything bad on Connor. He is who he is. This guy is a double champion. Connor helped change the sport. Sometimes he made the wrong choices, but that's the situation. Do you agree with Gilbert Burns? Share your thoughts in the comments below. Tony Ferguson and Khabib Nurmagomedov seem to still be at war despite the fact that the two have never really met in the UFC octagon. Tony recently accused the Eagle and his manager Ali Abdelaziz of owing him a substantial sum of money from a business arrangement in a tweet directed at them. Ferguson stated that Nurmagomedov and Abdelaziz owe him almost half a mil despite the specifics of the disagreement not being disclosed. Here is his tweet. You're still my bitch Khabib, Ali Abdelaziz. You owe me over half a mil now. I'll take it off your heads like a haircut as you did business wrong with me. Daddy don't forget. Check it out, I'm a tracker taught by my pops. Never like to kill, but for you. The two fighters enmity was well known in the UFC, and there were five scheduled fights between them that eventually were postponed for a variety of reasons. But they never had the chance to resolve their disagreements inside the cage. Thanks for watching. If you're a fan of MMA be sure to hit the subscribe button and turn on notifications, so you never miss an update. Also leave a comment below with your thoughts on today's news. Keep supporting the sport, and we'll see you in the next one.